Toning refers to the process in which paints of two or more colors are mixed to create a desired color. We will learn the basic toning process with the aid of operational adjustment cases of solid color paints. Steps Metered toning Blade coating color test panel color comparison Spray color test panel fine toning and countermeasures against excessive color master batch adding. The meter toning. Confirm toning formula. Confirm color numbers first. Vehicle body colors are distinguished by color codes, and the general color number is indicated on the center column plate or in the engine compartment. Check and confirm the corresponding color cards or color data provided by the paint manufacturer. If a color has many color variants, you have to make comparison against the actual vehicle color so as to select the closest color card. If the coating surface to be compared is not clean, it is impossible to compare the color accurately. Be sure to remove all traces from the surface using polishing wax so as to restore the original color and gloss. The result of comparison against color card color shows that the first color yellow is too intensive and the second black is too intensive. Among the three colors, the third color can be judged as the closest color. Therefore, we view the color formula for the third color card. This method can also be used if a new color is encountered or is not available in the actual toning process. Select the color card closest to the color and perform the metered toning. Metered toning. Prepare the color master batch paint to be used. The paint in the color master batch barrel will settle to the bottom and therefore need to be thoroughly mixed with the mixing cap before use. It is recommended to mix the color master batch paint daily. Select a container to contain the paint. Use an electronic scale to pour out the required amount of the color master batch according to the color master batch formula. Weigh the color master batch with higher content in the formula first so as to prevent the paint containing the color master batch with a lower content from adhering to the container wall surface such that it can be hardly mixed to the maximum extent. To add paint using a color master batch barrel, tilt the color master batch barrel and pull the operating lever on the slurry cover. If the operating lever has been pulled before the color master batch barrel is tilted, it will be difficult to control the poured out amount required, and it is possible to pour a large amount of paint at one go. Once all paints have been added, mix them using a blended ruler until the color is uniform. Be sure to mix thoroughly all the paints that may have adhered to the container wall. Blade Coating Color Test Panel Using the Blade Coating Color Test Panel can reach the target color faster. Allow the paint to adhere to the end of blending ruler for about 30 millimeters. Gently rub the paint on the color test panel by the weight of the ruler and apply the paint onto a right triangle greater than 30 by 30. If you press too hard the blending ruler, as shown in this picture, the paint will not adhere to the test panel, but just form a thick coating. After the reserve curing time is over, dry the test panels in the oven. If the curing time is omitted, pinholes will appear on the surface and result in an inaccurate result of color comparison. The color will change as the paint dries. After the paint is scraped, the original homogeneous pigment will be separated with the drying of the paint, and the color with higher specific gravity of pigment sinks to the bottom, while the color with lower specific gravity of pigment rises to the surface, and the color before paint drying is different from the color after drying, so the color comparison shall be conduct after drying. Color Comparison Compare the color test panel with the body steel panel. To conduct comparison using actual vehicles, you have to use the steel panel adjacent to the position to be sprayed. 
The ideal distance from eyes to color panel for color comparison is the length of the arm. Put the color test panel on the steel panel and check the color from at least three angles, front, oblique angle, and lower oblique angle. If there is a gap between the two colors, it will be hard to find the color difference and hard to conduct an accurate color comparison. Identify which color master batch paint needs to be added is an important part for toning. Used first impressions when judging colors. If you look at a color for too long, the eyes of the observer will experience visual fatigue and adapt to the color, making it difficult to make a judgment. For this color, it can be seen that the white is too intensive and the yellow is insufficient. If it is difficult to judge which color master batch paint is necessary to add, the following methods will be helpful. Identifying the missing color. Method 1. If the meter toning paint is obviously too white, approximately 50 grams of the color master batch coating other than white is required to meter and pour into small containers of which the quantity shall be equal to the quantity of color master batches other than white. A color master batch is added to the containers according to 20% of value indicated in the color master batch formula, and the paint shall be thoroughly mixed with caution. The color of the paint will be completely changed if the color master batch with a relatively low formula proportion is added excessively. Scrape the color test panel, wait till the reserved curing time is over, and judge the paint color master batch with the closest color at color comparison as the missing color master batch paint. Method 2. Observe the color master batch characteristic card provided by the paint manufacturer according to the color types of color master batches indicated in the color formula. The general color card will include the color of pure color master batches and the color of the color master batch mixed with white. This will help the stoning staff to quickly understand the color characteristics and make a judgment on the color difference. Add the missing color master batch paint. Add the missing color master batch paint as per the required amount. The amount added is determined empirically. If you have less experience in toning, you shall add a few missing color each time and observe the degree of color change. By repeating these steps, you may gain experiences and can predict the color change after the addition of a certain color. Add the missing color master batch to the metered paint. Mix the paint thoroughly. Scrape the mixture onto the color test panel using a blending ruler. Wait till the reserve curing time is over and dry the test panels in the oven. Conduct color comparison. If the paint is not the required color, pay attention to the extent of color change caused by the added amount and judge the required quantity next time. Conduct color comparison again till the toning result is close to the vehicle color. This process continues till the toning result is close to the vehicle color. Do not add two missing colors at the same time. Otherwise, it will be hard to know the functioning color. When color comparison is conducted by scraping the test panels, it is necessary to go to another color comparison process when the color comparison is finished. Spray color test panel fine toning. Paint mixing. Dilute the paint. Spray the paint using spray gun and check the paint color and pour the paint enough to spray on the color test panels onto a 100 gram container. Add curing agent and dilutant and mix them well. Follow manufacturer's instructions on dilution type and dilution ratio. Color test panel spraying. The first color test panel requires the check of the hiding power. Hiding power test panels shall be affixed in case of evaluation. Follow the manufacturer's instructions on spraying conditions. Wait till the reserved 
post-spray flash drying time is over, repeat steps for spraying and reserved flash drying time till the hiding effect is reached. Wait till the reserved curing time is over and dry the test panel in oven. Color comparison. To compare colors using color test panels and steel panels, the proper distance is the length of one arm, and the colors shall be checked from at least three angles, namely front, oblique angle, and lower oblique angle, to avoid errors caused by metamer, at least two different light sources, such as sunlight and fluorescent lamps, shall be used for color comparison. If toning is done indoors, use a toning lamp and check the colors from at least three angles, front, oblique angle, lower oblique angle. Adding the required color master batch paint. You might have to repeat for multiple times the procedure, namely adding the color master batch paint, spraying the color panels, and comparing the color panels till the result of color comparison shows that the colors are matched. Toning is over. It is a very difficult and important task to determine the degree of similarity of colors, namely, whether or not suitable. In the learning phase, it is preferable that many people assist in observing the color to judge the acceptability. Ask the experienced coating technician as much as possible. After toning is over, adjust the adjusted color formula. Save the color formula and spraying conditions together with the painted color panel. And countermeasures against excessive color master batch adding. Step. If the missing color master batch is added in excess, there are two solutions. Mix and add a paint that does not contain the over added color master batch, or utilize the complementary color relationship. Method 1. According to the color formula, use a paint that does not contain the overadded color master batch and mix it. Gradually pour the paint into the paint with overadded color master batch paint to reduce the hue of the overadded color. This method can gradually reduce the hue of the overadded color master batch paint without spoiling the balance of the color master batch paint so that its color matches with the color of the actual steel panel. The color balance will be destroyed if the color is added separately. Method 2. Through the complementary color relationship, mix a color completely opposite to the more intensive color so as to eliminate the more intensive color. The use of paints that are not included in the color formula will reduce the color saturation and cause metarism. Therefore, Pay special attention to this method. In the end, through the introduction and study of the above contents, we hope that you can master the correct solid color paint toning process and methods and can apply and improve them in practices.